And away they go with the rail mile ahead of them and uh, drifting towards the outside as they did in the earlier race. Flirting Bridges, one of the leaders just going on now from Shale in the white cap. November, the German Guineas winner, is racing strongly and now takes over from Flirting Bridge and Shale. Pretty Gorgeous is handy next with the white blaze and then alcohol free Empress Josephine in the dark blue jacket. Further back is Lullaby Moon on the outside of Potter Pova is a bit keen. On the near side, the grey snow lantern held up Mother Earth and finally Fevrova and there'd be about eight lengths first to last and it's the German filly November and David Egan that takes them along passing the five furlong marker so approaching halfway and about to angle across towards the home turn and it's November from Flirting Bridge and Pretty Gorgeous Empress Josephine on the inside out wide in the white cap is Shale followed by Alcohol Free then Lullaby Moon Snow Lantern Potter Pover Mother Earth still just with Fev Rover behind her as they run now passing the three furlong marker and about to swing the corner in the Group 1 Coronation Stakes. They come wide down the straight and it's November that still leads the way and has got a few of them at it here. In second place, Flirting Bridge. Pretty gorgeous. Then Alcohol Free, travelling better than some. On the outside, Mother Earth now begins to stay on from Empress Josephine and Snow Lantern also grabbing the ground. November being hauled in by Pretty Gorgeous. Snow Lantern, Alcohol Free delivered on the near side as they race inside the final furlong and Alcohol Free came to take it up from November. Mother Earth stays on late, but it's alcohol free that has kicked away in the hands of Ashi Murphy and wins the coronation stakes from Snow Lantern in second. Mother Earth on the near side of November. Those two fighting it out third and fourth, and they're away from pretty gorgeous. The outcome to our